All right, Kenny, about halfway through spring practice, you know, we lost a lot on the defensive line, so you and some other guys are going to have to step up. What, what, do you, what kind of mindset are you in right now uh, during the spring? Well, I mean, as a whole, I feel like we're getting, we're getting right, we're doing everything right. And me, as an older guy, I have to make sure everyone does everything right. I have to be right. I have to make sure everyone's on time for everything. Everyone is in the playbook. Everyone's, basically, everyone's doing everything right. How much were you able to learn from, from two guys like Julius and, and, and uh, Davenport? I mean, Julius, Julius came in when I came in, and he happened to play his freshman when I didn't play. But Julius has always been like a big brother. I mean, he's always taught me a lot, always, you know, modeled his play. Always felt like he was the guy that everyone could look up to, not just myself. What are you going to have to do this year to, to make sure that we don't, there's not a drop-off on the defensive line? I have to make sure that everyone, everyone can play at the same level. That's the way the starters come off the field. It's not a drop off by the second or the third depth. Now, many people may not know that you're really an accomplished singer. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm a singer that plays football. I like to look at it that way. <laughs> what, what's one of your favorite songs to sing? I don't know. I like a lot of gospel music. I'm a real, real big fan of gospel. I like No Weapon by Fred, Fred Hammond. So, your last year, your senior year, you're going to get to play in Yulman Stadium. Will there ever be a chance for the crowd to hear you sing the national anthem? Hopefully on our first game back, or the first game of the season opens, I can sing it. It's up to you.